Minutes before the Egyptian-mediated ceasefire began, Hamas launched a barrage of rockets towards Israel, which it said was in revenge for what it called Israel's massacre in Gaza. One of the rockets landed in Bethlehem in the West Bank, hitting a Palestinian house. There were no casualties reported. The owner of the house described what happened. We were at home asleep when we heard a loud explosion that shook all of the houses. The windows and other things broke on all of our three floors and in my brother's houses on either side. Previous ceasefires in this four-week conflict have been broken, but there's hope that this one will last. Residents in Gaza took advantage of the declared truce to go out shopping for food. One said, the truce will allow us to look after our children and get food for them. Everything has been destroyed. No one could accept the situation we've been in, not Allah, not any human being, whether they're Muslim or non-Muslim. Our children have been killed, our women have been killed. Meanwhile, the Palestinian foreign minister is visiting the International Criminal Court in the Netherlands to push for a war crimes case against Israel.